giving you a voice. Making it loud our own way. Welcome, Welcome to, to the fun. fun. Darwin. On to you, Ben. All right. Um, so Darwin's not a Curie 2019 this year, but we've got some really strong, strong teams trying to push their way onto Einstein. The division is full of teams who've dominated in district play, especially. So it's going to be a fun ride for all the teams involved here. Now, the arguably the best team is not a district team in there. It's 2791. Um, they'd be the chalk pick to win the division right now. We've got a bunch of people showing off their 2791 shirts, Audrey included. Hey. Um, <laughs> yeah, so they have two uh, two wins from the number one alliance, the ability to consistently solo a rocket, and a really strong uh, sandstorm hatch game, which is uh, super valuable going into Worlds here. Um, so they've got the strongest OPR in the division. They're really going to be the team to beat, and they've had six weeks to practice since their last win. So, you know, who really knows what we're, what we're going to see here? It took everyone else a couple weeks to catch up to them. So, you know, they've had six weeks to get better from that. So we'll Are see what happens. Are they well-known outside the region, though? Are they well-known outside the region? No. That's what yeah. I need to know. I've never yeah, heard of that's them That's a good question. I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I hope so at this point. Um, all right. So now I'm going to start blitzing through a lot of team numbers a lot faster here. Uh, it gets very even. Wide band of robots that uh, that really could either pair with 2791 or pair together or uh, a whole bunch of crazy stuff. We got a lot of district winners, basically. We've got three district championship winning captains and 125, the Neutrons, 225, Tech Fire, 868, the Tech Hounds, 3604, the Goon Squad. Everyone but 2604 has one additional events besides their champ wins. And, you know, Goon Squad, you can consider it they won too because they won all the way through Fimstein. So, I mean, it, it's it's it, we've got a lot of talent here. Um, we've got a bunch of teams also that were either the number one seed or number one picks on their division who just couldn't close the deal for whatever reason at their district champs. We've got 1918 NC Gears, 3707 the Brighton Techno Dogs, uh, 8, 836 the Robo Bees, and 1690 Orbit. Uh, so none of these teams are able to close the deal at their district champs. But all of them really could take home the division this weekend. Uh, 1918, they won the very difficult East Kentwood event, uh, one of the hardest district events of the year. Um, and uh, 3707 has won two districts. Um, and 1690 has built an incredibly strong score that's been in the very defense-heavy Israel district uh, that they've had to work through, too. So they, uh, they've really had to deal with the defense, and they could come out swinging here. 3707 is also one of the members of Team Suction, and they also have a strong two-hatch sandstorm on the front of the cargo ship and um, have the swerve drive that could... Uh, they're kind of a, a mad town light in many ways. Uh, I, I, say, I, say oh. this, I say this with love. Yeah. So anyone from 3707, this is said with love. 3707 is uh, sort of... I've heard people describe them as Walmart 1323. Oh, man, really? <laughs> Yeah. Which is and it not in a bad way. Like that's, that's not game. that's yeah. not a bad thing at all. They've got the dirty swerve. The dirty swerve is beautiful. They just build the weirdest robots. They have no design leads, so they just come out with these robots. I love thirty seven oh seven with all my heart. So it's just dirty swerve. swerve. Dirty swerve. Yeah, everything is functionally in the same place as Mad Town's robot, right? It's just different. Yeah. It's, yeah. it's <laughs> almost exactly the same as Mad Town's, just like if 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 Mad Town was name brand. And you bought thirty seven oh seven at Walmart, like <laughs> and like I said, I say that with love because they are so damn good too. On top of it, like with their dirty swerve, and it's beautiful. Anyway, that's my anyway. rant. <laughs> anyway, they, they've got a lot of capability and functionality that functionally, I'm sure, puts them on a lot of teams' uh, first pick list going into this event. So obviously, everything changes when you get there. But you know, it, it, it's uh, I, I think uh, props to them for really analyzing and trying to get the right stuff for this game here. Because uh, I think they're doing a good job. Um, so Michigan bringing many other top teams into play here. Um, just going to list off a lot of them. We got 217, the Thunder Chickens, 245, Adam Bots, 2337, two Engineers, 3667, uh, Mechanum Knights, 5567, Code Red Robotics. They've all won district events. Uh, we've got other Michigan teams who've also done well. We've got uh, 3542 Speed, uh, 503 Frog Force, uh, 2771 Code Red Robotics and the Stray Dogs, and 51 Wings of Fire. 
they haven't won events yet, but they're trying to do it here, and they've done well at some of their other events. So um, they could very well be on the limbs and alliances. We've got some strong FMA teams in Darwin, stronger than a lot of the other divisions. Uh, 1923 was with 222, who we talked about earlier. They were eight points away from making finals at FMA champs. Uh, they're also a member of Team Suction. Tyler pulled up the photo right there. Um, we've got 1676. They won an out-of-district NE event, and they've been a captain of high selection at all their events. Uh, functionally, probably the fifth or sixth best uh, robot scoring in FMA right now, so they're pretty good. Um, 103 is a good score. They've had some bad luck in quarterfinals their event so far, um, but they're really good this year. We've got 365 Mo, who was captain at an FMA champs district, at, or add FMA champs, and they n were number one seed at their second district event. Uh, from CHS, we've got 449, the Blair Robot Project. They won a district event, and there were three points from taking CHS district champs. Um, in NE, we've got uh, 3555, Illuminati. They've got better one of the better Lobots in the division. We've also got 88, TJ Squared. They've also built a great robot that can play all aspects of the game, but they have yet to win an event. Um, two other wild cards we kind of got here are 1024 and 771. They both won their respective district champs as robot number 24 playing defense, and we could expect them to maybe run that same strategy here in Detroit, um, and we'll see how the defense bots fall here in the uh, Illum rounds. So with uh, so much district firepower that we've got going on, uh, many of our dark horses may end up being some of our regional teams, so I'm going to go through a couple of those. Uh, from the regional system, we've got 5348 Charger Robotics, um, who was number one pick and finalist at their only regional, and they made it to uh, champs. We've got 16 Bomb Squad. They won Midwest as the number two seed and was the number one seed and finalist at Rocket City. They've also got a swerve drive and can do all aspects of the game. No, or sorry, they didn't win Midwest. Sorry, sorry about that. They were semifinalists. Thank you, uh, thank you, Tyler, for correcting me. Um, 41-43 was a finalist at CIR this year. They were at a swerve drive and a robot with high potential. Internationally, we've also got 4253 Raid Zero from Taiwan. They were the finalist and captain at Hawaii. We've also got uh, 4481, the Rembrandts, who was a semifinalist and early pick at two California events this year. Anyway, I listed off 33 teams there. Uh, so not all these teams are going to make the playoff rounds. Uh, so really, who knows which way this could go. I, I think... Um, the, it's the the one who's going to win is going to be some combination of 2791 and uh, and or two of the district winners, number one seeds or number one picks. So some of those that group of teams is going to team up and ultimately win this division. Um, and given the profile, I wouldn't be surprised if a lower seed won it um, and then they snake someone good on the back end and it uh it came through that way this this really is totally up for grabs someone could fall all the way to number one it depends if teams emerge if like shaker ends up better than everybody else or brighton ends up better than everybody else or something like that you know who really knows what way this could go so um it, i don't know <laughs> i could see shaker orbit happening as well i know orbits had some problems getting to the finals but i think that's more a strategy thing rather than a capability thing so I know the Strat team at 2791, they're pretty solid. So the two of them pairing up, like those two robots complement each other really well. So like expect to see them somewhere in that conversation. Yeah, I was going to say I'm a big fan of Orbit. Like if they just get their strategy down. Yeah, and then uh, for the two CHS teams that are on the field, 449 and 836, they are necessarily aren't going to be as appealing because they can only go for uh, game pieces from the loading station, both cargo and hashes. But they're both willing to go defense, and I think that's good. What's going to be appealing for them when the, when it comes to Elam's picking? I, I already know. gave my rant. I already gave my rant. So I mean, Ben <laughs> kind of listed. Ben kind of just listed off so many teams. That's like you did. You did pretty good. Yeah. You covered everything basically. Yeah, I think we're good. Yeah. I, I don't want anyone to let get teams. left out in the cold here. You know, there, there's yeah, a lot no. of great teams in this division. We need your help to keep fun loud, live, and independent. Help us by visiting our Patreon to pledge your support at patreon.com forward slash first updates now. You can also support fun live on Twitch for a few bucks a month or by linking your Prime account for free and clicking subscribe. Thank you to all of our co-executive producers keeping fun loud, live, and independent.